Good morning, Rach. Good morning. It is Friday. It is Friday, yeah. It's not the 13th, though, right? No. Okay. 15th. Oh, okay. I was going to say, I didn't I want know. any bad luck today. I know. We don't need any bad luck. We already had a flat tire yesterday I had to deal with. That's why I have, like, dog hair, I guess. Mellow. We have a great Pyrenees at home. Oh, yeah. If you guys don't know. I came home the other day, and the whole lawn was white. <laughs> Paige gave him a bath and blew him off and yeah. all the hair was all over the front lawn oh my goodness so much hair yeah he's shedding right now because it's like change of season mm -hmm. um and he does shed a little differently than i think an outside pyrenees would can you we're back yeah so i had to get that phone call but um what we were saying is mellow you know because he's an inside pyrenees he does shed a little differently than an outside Pyrenees would, um, especially the weather is so funky right now. So did they leave like... over there? They left. Yeah, they left. Yeah. Right. So there's room for this truck to go. Yeah. So it just seems like he's shedding like a lot more. I don't know. Definitely. He's like, it is funny though because when he is brushed and de-shedded, I guess he does look a little thinner. <laughs> but he still weighs 150 something pounds. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. It's funny, when he's wet, he really looks like a drown rat. Definitely. <laughs> but So, we are going to mow this one today. We, yes. We didn't, we aerated this one, they seeded it, um, we're just mowing it, and then I think after we're done mowing this one, we're going to do, go do a pruning, right? Mm hmm We have to finish that one that I started yesterday in the back, and then we got to do an abelia in the driveway and another one. But I think I'm going to start with that one first. The abelias. Yeah. Yeah, because I was thinking if we didn't get to the other one, we could always come back up. Yeah, so. Because there's nobody there. And we have to get to the Abelia. So, yeah. So. Um, But, yeah. So, we're going to get as much time And it's going to be 83 degrees again yeah, today, guys. Crazy. 83. In October. But, but tomorrow's going to be 62, so. One extreme to the other. <laughs> but I think I was right, boss. I seen, and we are not even supposed to go into the 30s now. Wow, um, that's crazy, and right? all the way until the 29th of October, we're a high of 66, I think I seen, and a low of 48, when our average high is like 62, and our lows are like in the upper 30s, mid 30s. We normally would have had our first freeze frost by now, right? Um, maybe a light frost. A light frost. We haven't even seen that. Or just about to have one, yeah. maybe. I think the 20th Like, sometimes around, October. yeah, sometimes around, like, the 20th. Now, I do remember we didn't actually have one. It was really nice up until November 1st, one year. Because remember Halloween, Halloween was nice. it was so warm. It was, like, 75 degrees, and we were all out trick-or-treating and, like, so hot. And then November 1st, we woke up to... Snow. Yeah. I don't think that's happening this year. I don't think we're no. going to get our first, like, hard frost freeze until, like, mid-November or beginning of November. Like, maybe the 7th of November, I've been saying. Yeah. So, we'll see. Let's get we'll out see. and get this done. All right. Here's the first one we're doing. I'll get it mowed up. Maybe get some of Rachel mowing in the back. It's probably long. But I need my hearing protection. Not bad. some of this extra grass off and then we're done this one they didn't want us to weed eat anything so nice
Okay, this one's done. Um, as you can see, it's bald underneath, but it's an abelia. It'll fill back in. That thing will grow twice as fast in half a year um, when springtime comes anyway, so. Yeah. Does she want that tulip poplar removed back there? Probably. Yeah, I wouldn't Probably. think that she would want a tulip poplar. No, so we'll have to get in there. We have the snips, right? Yeah. So we're gonna work on this one next. This should only take us about 30 minutes. Yeah. Um, we're going to line all the tarps up. That's Rachel's way. She loves doing it that way. It's easier because, like, you see, it just, like, breaks right onto the tarp. I mean, I only have minimal cleanup now. So. Yeah. Thank you. So we pruned that abelia there, that one there took us approximately an hour and five minutes. And if you're wondering price wise, guys, we're going to charge 150 to do that. So just for guys who are getting into pruning that don't know prices yet, if it were a whole yard pruning, it would be definitely a lot more, but. Yeah, usually we're about anywhere between 360 to like 
five something for a little yard like this yeah, um right. anything bigger you get into the day range and our rate for the day is closer to nine now i yeah. think so okay let's go take a break and see what else we can get into boss Absolutely. guys here's the next one we're mowing this ain't that bad for how many days it is but then again we haven't had rain in a long time and we didn't even aerate this one so or seed it or fertilize it yeah And this is the theme of the day, traffic. In the middle of the woods, we're in traffic. And yeah. this line is miles long. Well, like we're at right where we're at right now, there's a light around two curves, probably a half a mile up the road, and it goes all the way back. I think it was almost to the Dollar General back there. Yeah, it was. <laughs> Look at all the leaves fall. See them? Yeah. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Oh my gosh, that's so crazy, right? <laughs> oh my gosh, look at all of them. You hear them? Yeah. It's raining leaves, guys. One good, like, windy rainstorm. Well, guess what? I think there's a 20 mile an hour winds on Sunday. Yeah. Or tomorrow. No, I think tomorrow. Because I told you tomorrow the temperature was dropping. Oh, right? man. We're going to have to go in the one that we just aerated. We're going to have to. I, I did tell her. I kind of warned her that we're probably going to have to come blow leaves before. So me and Rachel always joke around. Right. We watched. We seen when they put this topiary in. Right, Rach? Yeah. See that thing right there? And the little tiny baby topiary. You know it was a topiary. They paid extra money for it. Uh -huh. It had pretty swirls. It was nice and tight. And now it's just an arborvitae. No. An Alberta spruce. And now it's just an Alberta spruce that they could have gotten for a quarter of the price. Oh, yeah, I'm sure. Right? Because those spiral ones are like, yeah, often yeah. Like triple. Crazy, right? I don't know why they didn't cut it anymore. Unless it was given to them. But it's been there for a couple of years and we watch it every year. It fills in more and more and mm -hmm. it's a, just a regular... Alberta spruce now. <laughs> oh man, that's a nice fescue on right there. Oh, right? Really? You seeded that last week. What is that? That's all vines, man. Really? <laughs> yeah. Oh my God. Throughout the whole yard. Okay, we're slowly but surely making it to our next job. It'll yeah. take us half hour longer probably. <laughs> no, it's great. But it's the last one of the day.
too bad, not too bad. We don't mow this one though. We did aerate and seed this one. Looks nice. See guys, we mowed. Remember the traffic we were sitting in? Yeah. This is it right here. Still. Let's see how far it goes. I would hope it's not as bad now, right? No, it's still pretty bad. When we were in it though, it was way down further. Yeah. When we were in it, it was probably another half a mile this way. But not no more. I think it was all the way to the dollar store, wasn't it? Yeah, it was, was it? almost all way the way. Way past there, yeah, but. Way. So we are done. We are done. Before we get into our ending here, well, what the heck was that? The this, windows open and the goon helm realized we were home. This is our ending, but um, before we get into that, we want to tell you guys we appreciate so much you guys watching. Um, we really do appreciate you so much. So if you've watched the video all the way to the end and you're a new subscriber, thanks. Yes. If you watch it all the way to the end and you're an old subscriber, usually you do watch it to the end. Yes. So we, we appreciate that. We appreciate that. We are getting rid of Happy's family. Um, we made the decision we are going to change the channel name, yes. right, to Happy's Lawn Care and Landscaping. Um, that's why, if you guys notice, we've been doing every other day videos, and we are going to start a new channel. Um, that's going to be, what are we going to name that one? We're going to name that Happy's Family Farm. And we are separating the lawn care and landscaping from the farming. Um, yes. Some of you guys love to watch farming only. Some of you guys love to watch lawn care and landscaping. So we decided to separate the two. And if you like to watch both, we appreciate it if you go subscribe to the new channel. Yes. Um, it will be up by the time you guys seen this. Um, I'm going to start working on it. I would have started working on it right away. Yeah. And the reason we're doing that, we're still going to do the vlog with the, not daily, we're still going to do the vlog with the lawn care when we go out and do jobs and stuff. That'll still be the same. Um, more of the family stuff and the the farming, what we want to get into later on in life with the farming, growing our own vegetables, homesteading and everything. We are going to put on that channel specifically. So all our hiking, pretty much everything not to do with lawn care and landscaping, yeah. we're going to put on to that channel. We figured it was time to maybe separate it. Um, and we appreciate all of you guys watching and like Coral said, most of you do watch our videos all the way through and you don't care if it's lawn care or landscaping or just we're hanging out at the house or taking a hike. And we appreciate that. But, um, it is, but it's going to make it easier for me. Like when I try to do farm videos and like we got a still and everything and the worms and all to do with farming. For me to add that into daily vlogs, it's kind of hard. So yeah. I kind of want to do videos specifically on that process because we're doing a lot of learning things with the worm composting. Yeah. With the distilling, if I'm even saying it right, with the oils. That's all going to be part of future plans for the farm, for the market and everything. Well, but and you guys have heard us say also um you know our ultimate goal and our dream is to be able to own our own property lots of property and eventually turn that into a farm a farm market and create something for yeah. you guys to come and either buy flowers come hang out um do all kinds of stuff with the family mm -hmm. um hopefully we get there one day but yeah. we're gonna do it early and separate this channel mm -hmm. and then we'll get more into doing that on the other channel like cleaning up the garden getting stuff ready maybe even growing winter vegetables under like little greenhouses yeah but if you're interested in that part you'll go to that you can please go to that channel please. and like subscribe and share with that channel yes if you're not then just stay here and watch the lawn care and landscaping but just in case you guys were wondering that's why the channel has been changed yeah so we definitely um enjoy all of your comments and we hope to grow that channel too just as quickly so if you guys could please share um that would be wonderful and please um keep in mind that we are going to start putting in little giveaways uh because we hit 10,000 on this channel 
we are going to start hiding little giveaways into the videos. Yes. Um, and the reason that we're hiding them in the videos is because we do want to make sure that our our subscribers that, that are, are coming loyal, back all the time yeah. and watching nothing against people who just watch it one time it's just that we want to give back to people who watch consistently who comment consistently mm -hmm. um and all that good stuff yeah that have been watching us for years that, that helped us build these cha this channel and hopefully help us build the next channel yeah so just keep your eye out and make sure that you're watching lives and all that great stuff um, but again, we do appreciate you. So please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And remember, guys, be happy. Or at least try. Have a good night. Have a good night. And that'll be our saying still in the other one, too. That's always going to be always. our saying. It will always so. be our saying because life is just too short yes. and we've lived. I know that you guys say, oh, you're young. <laughs> but um, just be happy. Yeah. Be happy, guys. Have a Have good a night. Good night.